Hi everybody, we're going to start a mandala test drawing right now to see how the document camera works. So hang tight and I'll be right back. All right, so you can see that I have my mandala drawn from this morning and I'm going to see if I can do that same one again step by step just so you can see how it's done. A little bit closer, a little bit easier to see. So I started with a Baby Yoda nose in the middle, which is like a rounded triangle with bumps on the bottom. And then I added his little hand, his three little fingers behind the nose and a little fingernail on each, a little triangle fingernail. You didn't do that. You just added it right now. Then I'm going to add his eye shape behind and his Mom, little nose me. wrinkles. I want to do it too, so wait for me. Okay. All right, so Kate is joining us now, and she's all caught up. <laughs> yep, yep, and Maggie's going to help too. So next, we are going to add in the lines around Baby Yoda's eyes. So we're going to start with a big arch above his eye and fingers. And then another one close to it, just like this. These are the wrinkles around his eyes. And then two on the bottom that are a little bit closer to the eye. One more? Uh-huh. Right, just like that. Oh, Mom, look at mine. It's looking great. All right, now we're going to add some forehead wrinkles. So I'm going to do those right on top of the eye wrinkles. Just some bumps. And then I'm going to do one more. One more layer. Okay, you can look in the um, camera too to see what I'm drawing because my arm's in the way. On two? Yeah, I did it over like two. So they're a little bit bigger. I know it doesn't look like Baby Yoda, you know, himself, like his face, but it is capturing the essence of Baby Yoda. We can see the shape of his eye and his wrinkles and his fingers. I can't see him. You can't? Eye. This is his eye shape right here. And if we wanted to, we could color that in to make it really dark. Now, Kate, you're not going to have room for big ears like I am. I'm going to make really big ears. Yours can just be a little bit smaller, okay? All right, so finish out your wrinkle line, and then we're going to draw some ears. All right, so right from here, we're going to draw a line straight out, almost as far as we can to the edge of the board. And same on this side. Okay. Then we're going to turn this kind of into a triangle, but it's got a wobbly edge close to the eye. So pointy on the outside and big on the inside. Very nice. Are those okay? ears? Yes, those are his ears. And so then the, this is the top flap of his ear. And then the inside flap of his ear shows just a little bit like this one? on the yeah. bottom. So there's a line that goes right on the bottom. Let me erase that. You want to fix his ear? Mm hmm And do a little bump right here. Okay. All right, Maggie. I thought you did that on He needs stick. some little hairs coming out just like this. Can you do the hairs? Mm -mm. Oh, I thought you wanted to help. No, mm -mm. Mm -mm. Okay. 
Nice kid. Nice. Very nice. Okay, I did some little hairs on top of his head wrinkles. Uh -huh. Ooh, nice. Okay. okay. That's easy. All right, and now we're gonna do his collar. So we're gonna start with a big swoop here, a medium swoop, and then a line close to it. Like the eye. Mm hmm And then I don't think you have room, Kate. That's okay. Yours can stop there. I have a little bit more room, so I'm gonna do this. I can always this and do a little bit. Do it closer? Mm -hmm. okay. okay. Good. All right. Whoops. Can you erase my ear? All right. And let's do that collar around the top, too. Thank you, Maggie. That's Let's not nice. Now what should we do? I think that might be it. I think he's done. Oh, the mom was almost so like so in trouble. So yeah. Oh, all right, Maggie. Would you do some lines like this all the way around? Okay. All right. So, at this time. Oh, can I draw my name so they know my name? Uh -huh. Good job, Maggie. Keep going. That's my name. 